All right, guys, uh, we're going to do an interesting variant of the uh, Romanian deadlift or the hip hinge. Now, this exercise, um, it doesn't really emphasize the lower body, body part of this. Um, it is going to place a little bit more load on your back muscles, which is a good thing. Um, but where it's really challenging is actually shoulder stability. Um, so we've been playing around it, with it a little bit to train this overhead position and, and to teach people to hold there when they go, for example, into an overhead squat or a snatch when they're dropping down into a squat and they have to hold that overhead position. So I'm going to start with the dowel on top of my head, 90 degrees at my elbows. I'm going to keep my rib cage position so I'm not dumping into my lower back and I'm just going to drive over my head. I'm going to hold this position, keep myself nice and stable, and then I'm going to go forward into my hinge. And as I do that, I'm going to make sure that my hands don't drop and that my head does not drop. I'm trying to keep myself strong in this position and then drive back up. Reset on the top, hold your strength, lock it in. Hold. And come back up. Whew. And that is challenging. Obviously, you can use a barbell with a little bit of weight in it, but trust me, I don't think you'll need to. You can start with a dowel, and if you want to add a little bit more resistance, you could always uh, start with a weighted dowel. Um, but yeah, most likely, this will be quite enough. So overhead hinge, where we're going to be working with this guys is through all of the stabilizers through our shoulder girdle. So it's actually an excellent exercise to train this overhead position and lock that in. Give her a go and have fun.